Abby Klein. Your next comedian coming to the stage. I love her. She's so funny. You will too. She has eyelashes for days. Give it up for Leslie Liao. I'm a woman. Yeah. Do you believe me? I'm a woman. Uh, and I don't ask for much. I just, uh, I just feel like I should be addressed in a certain way in public. Like maybe I'm too young for ma'am, but recently at Trader Joe's, the cashier called me buddy. And it hurt my feelings. So I'm from Orange County. Um, suck. And, uh, I grew up in a really nice neighborhood, and in high school we went through this super weird, like, emo, punk metal music phase, which never made sense to me. Like, I'd always see a car full of bros driving by, blasting, like, Cut my life into pieces, this is my last resort! Well, they're all, like, sipping on a Jamba Juice and pulling into a gated community. Like, like, relax. <laughs> You're not a tortured soul, Brendan. Chill. <laughs> so, I'm an Asian. <laughs> no, I've always known. I've always known. <laughs> and uh, I have a, you know, my mom's. I have an Asian mom. And uh, she was really hard on me to do well in school. And I could, like, never relate to my white friends. Because, like, white parents are always like, I know you're trying, sweetheart, but heck, if you don't pass science, I might have to take away your TV privileges. <laughs> Do you know what my mom would say to me? <laughs> if you no get A, <laughs> your shame and dishonor will kill me in my sleep. <laughs> Do you want me to die? I mean, I don't want you to die. I don't want you to die. I love you. I'm sorry. So I'm Asian, but I have a lot of white friends. <laughs> uh, weird thing to clap for. Weird thing to clap for in 2019. That's very strange, sir. But I feel a lot of pressure to impress my white friends by like representing my Chinese culture. Like every time we're out at dinner, I always take charge. Like, ni hao ma, can we have some dan chao fan and some lo bo gao gong shi fa tai shi shi. My friends are like, Leslie, this is a P.F. Chang, so I'm like, Super's name is Jared. You should take it easy. <laughs> So I am a woman. I think it's fun being a woman. Um, it's very easy to make girlfriends. Like, women bond very easily. Like, we bond by sharing secrets with each other. Um, and women are so honored to be trusted with a secret. We'll agree to it, like, right away. Like, like every time a girl asks another girl, it's like we're pledging to some Illuminati shit. Like, if a girl's just like, promise me you won't tell anyone what I'm about to tell you. She's like, I swear. <laughs> What are women even doing with this highly classified personal information about random people? Like, I doubt the CIA is interrogating some chick in a remote location. Like, okay, Stephanie, for the last goddamn time, what did Noah do to make Carly cry on New Year's Eve? <laughs> I think that's why women like walk around with this little like like shimmy in our shoulders, you know, like this little like pep in our step. We're just gonna hold all the secrets in. It's just so silly how much we know. I know David's dick Ben's leg. I'm an adult, 
Um, I'm an adult woman, and it's not as fun as I thought it would be. I'm celebrating a bunch, but I'm just celebrating like milestones for my friends. Like every weekend's a baby shower or an engagement party, and it's like, as a single adult woman, no one has anything they want to celebrate for me. Like that's not fair. Like I'm accomplishing things. Like I'm. I finally got over my ex that ruined my 20s. I think that's something to celebrate. And to that. Like I'm, I'm emotionally available again. Does anyone want to throw me a themed brunch? Like I would go. <laughs> Being an adult is a lot of work. But I just, I don't like that it's turned into a hashtag, hashtag adulting. Because it's just these 20 year old kids tweeting out stuff like, like vacuumed my entire room today, hashtag adulting. <laughs> Made my own doctor's appointment, hashtag adulting. Like you don't get a high five for your little errands. Like you don't know what it's really like to be an adult. Like a real adult would tweet out stuff like, watching my parents slowly die, hashtag adulting. <laughs> When I sit for too long, my hips hurt. Hashtag <laughs> I get sad on my birthdays now. Yes. Hashtag adulting. <laughs> you clap and laugh if it's true. <laughs> I was told. Uh, so I'm single. Um, and uh, the silence is very symbolic. That was very <laughs> Uh, but it's hard being single like and being like a female comic because like I'm sassy and I like to make fun of people um, But nobody wants to fuck Don Rickles <laughs> I can't keep treating every date like it's a roast battle <laughs> Just like hey, would you get those pants Abercrombie you bitch gay? <laughs> I'm single and like I, I like it, I'm happy, I enjoy it, but I'm getting older and uh, all my friends are always trying to freak me out. They're just like, like Leslie, aren't you scared you're gonna die alone? I'm like, I'm an Asian female. I don't think we even die. I'm all, I'm all set. Like, I don't know what happens to us. I think um, I think we just shrink and float away. <laughs> I'm excited. Thank you guys so much. I'm